Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to the Scan Tool Network. In this video, we are going to demonstrate the X-Tool D7. Uh, we have an airbag light on this Audi Q5, so we're just going to run through a really quick demonstration of this tool, diagnosing the fault and resetting the airbag light. Okay, so the tool is plugged into the diagnostic port. If you are interested in this tool, by the way, use the link in the description below this video because there are fakes, there are clones out there that can damage your vehicle, so you don't want to go down that route. So make sure you use the genuine and official tool, which is in the link in the description so we're going to click on to diagnosis we're going to click on to Europe and we'll find Audi and we'll go to manual selection because we wish to diagnose the um, Audi Q5 in fact no what you can do is you can select that or you can go to automatic detection so it automatically finds your vehicle and there we go it's found us straight away so then you can go to full system diagnosis, find the airbag system, which is there. And then it should allow us to go to read trouble code, giving us one fault, B101A15. Um, it gives you information about the fault as well, but if you're not sure what that means, uh, put the fault code into Google, it'll tell you what it means. And it'll tell you what to fix as well. In our case, we just found a loose connection underneath the driver's seat. So that is, uh, was very easy for us to fix. So we put the connection back in, but obviously we still got the airbag light there. Uh, so what you can do is click on clear trouble code. And when I click yes to that, just keep an eye on the airbag light when I click yes. And there we go, airbag light is gone no fault codes detected. We can go back in and click read trouble code it's telling us there are no faults now. Well this is a fantastic tool if you are interested in a, a tool which will um, allow you to uh, cover all makes and models, do special functions like service functions as well. There's a huge range of uh, functions there as well. So remember to use the link in the description below this video. Thanks for watching and I hope this helps.